Well, new tonight, the Gaston County man accused of killing his wife with eye drops in 2018, then setting a helicopter on fire and faking his own kidnapping is facing more charges tonight. Court documents just show the new allegations against Joshua Hunsucker include poisoning his child and harassing the parents of his late wife. WCNC Charlotte's Jesse Pierre has been going through the newly obtained court documents all day. Jesse, a lot of disturbing but new details there in that uh, paper there. That's right. Now, according to court documents, Joshua Hunsucker's 11 year old daughter was hospitalized last year and the same substance found in eye drops that killed Stacey Robinson Hunsucker, his late wife, was also found in his daughter's system. Now, documents say Hunsucker's goal was to try to take the heat of the murder accusation off of him and to pin it on Stacy's parents. Now, with all of these new accusations and charges, prosecutors want Hunsucker's bond revoked. Joshua Hunsucker back behind bars, now facing four counts of intimidating a witness and four counts of obstruction of justice. This is on top of the first degree murder and insurance fraud charges he is facing in the death of his wife, Stacy Robinson Hunsucker, in September of 2018. Two days after her death, Hunsucker filed to collect on her $250,000 life insurance policy. Hunsucker was arrested in December of 2019. Prosecutors say he poisoned her over time with a deadly amount of a component found in eye drops. He had been out on a $1.5 million bond since December of 2019 with electronic monitoring. Prosecutors now wanting that bond revoked. According to new court documents, in February of 2023, Hunsucker is accused of poisoning his daughter by using the same substance that killed his wife. Attorneys say this was an attempt to pin his wife's murder on his in-laws. Prosecutors also note several incidents of harassment and intimidation. This includes Hunsucker routinely taking pictures or videos of Stacey's parents, the Robinsons, driving by their home, sitting in the parking lot of the church the Robinsons attend, and making inappropriate gestures at them. Many of these actions done in front of his daughters. His behavior towards the Robinsons was noted to have become more and more aggressive. Now, prosecutors filed a motion for Hunsucker's bond to be revoked. The state says it is concerned that Hunsucker's dangerous actions will continue to escalate. Now, Hunsucker could be back in front of a judge as early as next week on this motion. I did reach out to both uh, to attorneys on both sides of this case, but have not heard back yet. Now, you can find more details on this click on, on this case, including a detailed timeline now on WCNC.com. Back to you guys.